Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back. I'm Melanie Kate Love and thank you so much for joining me here for another episode. Well, as you can see today, my location is a little bit different from usual and that is because I'm actually at my cousin's wedding today and the wedding is right on the beach so I thought I'd take a quick little 10 minutes in between the, um, the ceremony and the reception to talk about something really, really important that I've actually experienced this week, which is all about changing your perspective. Now, I feel that your thoughts towards a situation is going to manifest that within your reality. So for instance, let's just look at um, our bodies. So if you have negative thoughts in regards to your body, well, then you're never going to get that dream body of yours that you truly desire because your thoughts don't match the vibration in which you want to achieve. It's pretty amazing. So for me, what I have done recently is I've manifested my dream body because I've changed my perspective. Instead of sending like negativity and hate in the way that I was looking, I was actually changing that to be more uplifting and positive. As a result, so many amazing things have happened and I've actually spoken about it in depth in my Law of Attraction success story update, which was, I think it was about four weeks ago now. So you're welcome to check that out on the end card, which is amazing. Another thing is this week that I've been changing my perspective in the way that I have been dressing. Now, this is something that I have, I don't know, it's just within a week, I just noticed a massive change. So instead of just wearing like just normal like sweatpants to work, I was, because I work from home and I'm an entrepreneur, so I have the luxury to do that. Um, I was actually changing what I was wearing. So I was actually wearing stuff that I was would wear to a meeting if I was to have one and just that tiny little change changed my perspective in the way that I was working which in turn manifested to me becoming into more vibrational alignment which meant that I closed the gap to, of resistance it was just a little tiny little change I was also changing oh, was it only like what I was wearing I actually started putting on um, my eyebrows and I was putting on mascara and I just was like so against makeup for such a long time and I was like you know what the contrast isn't really really healthy and I found that by changing that I just felt so much better and so I just wanted to talk to you today just to let you know like, what things could you change your perspective around maybe you have someone that works with you that is nasty and you're like I hate this person I hate this person I hate this person and if you were to say if you just look for positive aspects I've actually spoken about that in my last video um, where I, it was about what was it called um, um, how to heal emotional blockages part two and I talk about the letter writing process and how important that is to, to get rid of those negative aspects which in turn changes your perspective so whatever is going on for you at this point on your journey to become the greatest version all I want you to do is just to think about what is something that you desire and think about what is your self-talk around that because I'm assuming that your vibration is matching your current reality. It's not matching your desire because there's just too much resistance in between. So think about that today, my loves, and I would love to hear from you in the comments below and let me know what is something that you could change your perspective around that is going to help you on your journey to become the greatest version because it's just, it's such a simple thing to think about, but to apply it is a completely different story. So yeah, I would love to hear from you in the comments. I need to go back and find my sister, my brother, um, and my partner, because um, I told them that you can't be here when I'm filming, that's just awkward. But I don't know what's more awkward, random people walking past. Um, yeah, I don't know, I'm so comfortable filming at home. That's just like my safe place. So I was like, I have to film a video. I can't miss another episode. I know I have been a little bit inconsistent recently, but that's because I'm finalizing my website so I can um, open up the wait list to release my um, private online spiritual readings, which I'm so excited to get to you very, very shortly. Anyways, my love, just think about that today. What is one area that you could change your perspective with that could drastically change your life? Another thing for me is I need to change in regards to my nail biting. I had to put fake nails on for the wedding because I was so embarrassed with the state that they had become. To me, if you ever meet me and you see that I have long nails and you can tell that they're natural, that means that I am truly 100% in alignment and I have been for a long time. There are times where I have been in alignment and then I fall out, which the contrast 
I'm still getting used to. I'm not perfect. Um, yeah. Anyways. So yeah, that's what I'm trying to change my perspective in regards to this. So when I start biting my nails, what can I do to change my perspective? So I don't put, cause you know, if you look at the metaphysics of eating your nails, it's basically eating away at the soul, which is like sabotaging yourself. Cause I'm like, the website's not going well. Well, I'm going to make sure that like I can feel pain in my skin, which is such a messed up way of thinking. <sighs> anyway, I just told you one of my deepest, darkest secrets and it's on the internet for the world to see. So that's pretty crazy. Anyways, my love, thank you so much for taking the time to support me continuously. And I just wanted to remind you to continue to make better choices and to change your perspective so you can vibrate on the frequency of love. I love you so much. Goodbye.